Hey, Blair Williams here. I'm the creator of Easy Affiliate and I wanted to welcome you to our community. We've put together this short video to help you get started growing your business by launching your Easy Affiliate program today. Now I'll hand it over to Carl who will give you a full tour, but please make sure to watch it all the way to the end so you don't miss out on anything. Thanks, Blair. We're excited to get you up and running with Easy Affiliate. In this video, I'll go over how to get everything set up on your WordPress site and tell you all you need to know to get up and running with your affiliate program. Now, before we dive into setting up Easy Affiliate, you need to outline how you want your affiliate program to work. You need to decide what commissions you're going to offer affiliates, when you want to pay them, and more. For this video, I'll be setting up a 30% commission, which means my affiliates will get 30% of the revenue for any sales they bring in. You can set whatever commission percentage you want. However, across the industry for digital products, you'll usually see around a 20 to 30% commission. Also, in this example, I'll be paying monthly, which Easy Affiliate is set up best for. We recommend having a waiting period before paying your affiliates to account for refunds and other circumstances that may occur. In this example, I'll have a waiting period of 30 days before my affiliates get paid. Just a side note, Easy Affiliate acts as a ledger. As commissions come in, it adds them to what your affiliates are owed until you, the merchant, pay them. Also, if a subscription or order gets refunded, it will remove that commission automatically from the affiliate's balance. Now that I've decided how my affiliate program is structured, let's jump in to setting up Easy Affiliate on my WordPress site. Once you download the Easy Affiliate zip file and upload it to your WordPress dashboard, you'll be directed to the Easy Affiliate setup wizard which makes setting up the basics of your program easy. The first screen of the wizard will detect and import settings from any other affiliate programs you were previously using on your site. If you don't have one, it'll register that and prompt you to save and continue. The second screen will integrate Easy Affiliate with various e-commerce plugins you have installed on your site. We currently support MemberPress, WooCommerce, and Easy Digital Downloads. Select which programs you want to use with Easy Affiliate and click Save and Continue. Next, enter or modify your business information. Here is the Affiliate Registration Information Setup page. The first section pertains to how people can become affiliates on your site. We recommend the first option, Application. This allows anyone to submit an application to become your affiliate, and they'll only become one once you approve of them manually. Public allows anyone to become an affiliate instantly. This is the most hands-off option if you don't want any oversight as to who signs up for your program. The third option here is private, which only lets people you manually add be part of your affiliate program. The next two options you'll see here are collect affiliate addresses and collect tax info. The on registration and on account toggles will hide or show inputs to collect your affiliate's addresses and tax information on either the registration page when the affiliate signs up or in their account page when they've already registered. Enabling the require toggle will make it so your affiliates must give you this information. The last section on this page handles your affiliate agreement. You can generate the default legal agreement here or paste your own. This toggle here determines if the agreement will show up when your affiliates are registering. Next, you'll select your commissions and payouts. Under commission type, you have two options, percentage and fixed amount. For this example, I'm going to choose percentage, which will pay affiliates a certain percentage of each sale referred. In my case, 30%. While not used as often, fixed amount might be useful if you want to pay a fixed amount for every sale referred, regardless of which product was purchased. The next thing you'll see here is the Add Level button, which allows you to create different tiers for your affiliate program. This is a more advanced feature that's beyond the scope of this video, so check out our knowledge base for more information if you plan to use a multi-level marketing approach. The next option you see here is Subscription Commissions. This lets you choose what transactions you'll pay out on in a subscription service. For example, our WordPress membership plugin MemberPress lets you create subscriptions that are automatically renewed on a monthly or yearly basis. If first sale is selected, then only the first payment in a recurring subscription is attributed to the affiliate any subsequent renewals will not be. If all sales is selected, then the affiliate gets earnings from the first payment of a subscription and all subsequent renewals of that subscription. The last part of this page lets you choose the method that you'll pay your affiliates with. 
PayPal mass payment file allows you to send bulk payments out to all of your affiliates and generally saves you on transaction fees. This involves downloading a payment file and uploading it to PayPal. Visit PayPal's help page to learn more about mass payments. The PayPal one-click option is similar to mass payments, but it sends your data directly to PayPal, so you don't have to download the payment file and upload it to PayPal. This process will happen automatically with the click of a button. The third option, offline, lets you handle paying your affiliates outside of PayPal, usually in the form of a mail check, gift cards, or any other method you choose. For my program, I'm going to choose PayPal one-click. The next page in the wizard is the creatives page. This allows you to upload graphics and text that allow your affiliates to advertise your products. They'll be able to access these through their affiliate dashboard and easily copy embed codes and URLs to use to market your products. We'll see this in action later in the video. Click add and select what type of media you're gonna be importing. For example, select banner to upload a graphic advertisement. Click choose image. Choose from your media library or upload a new image. Give it a name, which will give your affiliates a description of what the graphic is. Enter the URL that the image will direct to once clicked on your affiliate site, then click Add Creative. For text links, select Text, give it a name, a URL the link will lead to, and what the actual text itself will say. Once you're done with this, you'll be notified that you're all set to get up and running with your affiliate program. Here, you'll receive important links for your program your affiliate signup page, the affiliate dashboard, and a link to the Easy Affiliate blog where you can get all of the latest tips and tricks to make your Easy Affiliate program a success. Once you're all set up, you'll be able to access Easy Affiliate from your WordPress dashboard. Here, you can review affiliates activity, the clicks and sales they're generating, approve new affiliates, pay them, and much more. Check out our knowledge base to learn more about how to use all of these features. So to put this all together, I'm going to go through the process of an affiliate signing up for my affiliate program, advertising my products and links on their site, generating clicks and sales, and getting paid. So for this example, I have a sample affiliate site set up, which I'm an admin of. I have my program already set up with links and banners available to advertise with, and an affiliate signup page where people can get approved to be my affiliate. So now as a test affiliate, I'll go to my sample site and find the affiliate signup page. I'll fill in my name, email, and where and how I'm going to promote the site's products. I'll then click Apply. This will send the test affiliate's application to the site admin. So as the admin, I'll go to Easy Affiliate in WordPress. I'll click Affiliates and Applications. Here I can see the test affiliate's application with the status of Awaiting Approval. I'll click the test affiliate's name to bring up their application information. After reviewing it, I'll change the status as Approved and click Update. I'll then see that the affiliate's application has been approved. Now, as the test affiliate, I'll check my email and see that I've received a welcome email letting me know that I'm now an affiliate of the site. To complete my registration, I'll click the link here. This will take me to the affiliate signup page where I'll choose a username and password and review the affiliate agreement. I'll click sign up and receive this notice that I'll receive an email confirmation of my login details. In this email, I'll be given my login page where I can access my affiliate dashboard. So I'll click that, sign in, and be taken to the dashboard. To get some clicks and sales, I'm gonna to go to Links and Banners, then Banners, and click this graphic here. I'll copy this HTML and embed it on my site. Over time, this banner will generate some clicks which will ultimately lead to sales. So once this happens, I'll log back in as my admin. I'll go to Easy Affiliate and click Pay Affiliates. Here, under my affiliate's name, I'll be able to view all of the clicks they've generated and all of the sales they've referred. I'll check to make sure their status is eligible, meaning they've reached my minimum amount for payout. To pay them, I'll click the checkbox under Pay and then Pay Selected Commissions. And just like that, your affiliate has been paid. PayPal will send them an email notifying them of their payout. Now, we just briefly saw the affiliate dashboard in action. Once someone signs up for your affiliate program with Easy Affiliate, they'll have access to their affiliate dashboard, where they can not only get links and banners to advertise with, but also view their stats, payment history, and more. Your affiliates have everything they need right here in a simple, easy to use interface. Next, we'll log in as you, the merchant, to explore the Easy Affiliate settings page, 
where you'll be able to customize your affiliates dashboard we just saw and much more. I won't be getting into too much detail of all of the settings here, but I do want to show you how to customize your affiliate dashboard. So once you're logged in, go to Easy Affiliate and Settings. Click the Affiliates tab, scroll down to Dashboard, and you'll see options here to customize your colors and logo. Enable Pro Dashboard should be enabled. This is what activates your affiliate's custom dashboard. Below are options to customize your affiliate dashboard colors and to upload a custom logo to display on the page header. You can also customize the welcome message that will display on the affiliate dashboard welcome page. Another way to modify your affiliate's dashboard that's more of a real-time view is with the WordPress customizer. Go to Appearance and Customize. Then click Easy Affiliate Pro Dashboard. To use this feature, you'll need to have yourself approved as an affiliate on your site, and you'll need a link to the dashboard somewhere on your site to be able to display it here in the customizer. Here, you can have all the same controls to change colors in the logo. Using the customizer gives you a live update of your changes in real time. One other thing I'll mention here in the settings is the creatives page. Here, you can add, edit, and delete your links and banners. When your affiliates log into their dashboard, any changes you make here will be reflected to them. And there you go. You're now up and running with Easy Affiliate and have seen an overview of the settings and features you have available to you to run a successful affiliate program. Be sure to follow our blog at easyaffiliate.com blog and subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with Easy Affiliate's latest updates, tips, and tricks. And if you run into any trouble along the way, our support staff is always here to help. Thanks for watching.